Governor Brad Little's plan for reopening Idaho has local businesses excited. KIDK Eyewitness News 3 reporter Max Cohen shows us what some businesses have been doing in the meantime. Oh, I can't wait. Yes, I miss everyone. I'm anxious. It's stressful, of course, but got to do what we got to do. Local businesses are excited with a plan now in place to reopen under Governor Little's four stage plan. Stage two involves opening hair salons and restaurants if all criteria are met. That is tentatively set to begin on May 16th, marking the beginning of the end of a historically difficult period. We've done okay with our curbside and stuff like that. Um, you know, it's still not enough, but you know, you just gotta, you gotta battle through it. Everybody's going through the same things. Press Box owner John Kalibas says business has been down nearly 80% since the start of the stay home order. Recently, he's tried selling to go drinks to help. We haven't really sold that many, maybe 50 in a month. Some other places have probably sold more than that. But it's nice that the state allowed us to do that. When given the okay to open his dining room, Kalivas believes he'll see 50% of his customers back almost immediately, offering promotions to attract others. Pro Barber's owner Lacey Miller says she's expecting business to be buzzing. I have a feeling, I have quite a few people that are like, uh, you better make sure that I'm the first one on your books, or <laughs> I think we're going to be pretty darn busy. Miller says the shop, which opened in 1929, had never been closed for a month before. Recently, she's had customers offer to pay for a year's worth of haircuts just to make sure they can reopen. Now she's preparing for what could be the shop's busiest period yet. Make sure we have everything we need in stock. You know, we're just, we're going to have some long days, but it's going to be awesome. I can't wait. I miss everyone. Reporting in Pocatello, I'm Max Cohan. Both businesses said customers and clients have been extremely generous during this difficult period.